An outside spotlight with motion detector is great for lowering energy costs while increasing safety and security. Sometimes weather and time cause them to fail. Or perhaps you have a working outside spotlight without a motion detector, and you would like to add that feature. In either case, here's how to replace that existing outdoor fixture with a new motion detector fixture. First, find the circuit that supplies the power to the spotlight and turn off the circuit breaker. Remove the bulbs from the fixture. Using a voltage tester, place one test prong on the threads on the side of the socket and the other test prong on the center metal tab at the bottom of the socket and check to make sure that no voltage is present. Using a screwdriver, remove the screws holding the cover of the fixture to the base. Remove the cover. Inside you'll find the electrical wires connecting the light to the house electrical supply. Turning the two wire nut caps counterclockwise, carefully remove the two nuts from the wires. If there's electrical tape wrapped around the caps, you'll have to remove the tape first. Be careful not to touch the bare wires until you test them. With the wire nuts removed, Use a voltage tester to again check to make sure that the circuit is dead. When you're sure that no voltage is present, disconnect all the wires and remove the old fixture. Some motion detectors are attached separately to the house. If so, unscrew and remove the old motion detector from the house. This motion detector requires that a mounting strap be installed to the electrical box. As the installation of outdoor lights may vary, always follow the instructions that came with your specific light. It's very important that you hang the watertight gasket over the supply wires coming from the house before you attach the wires to the light fixture. First, install the bare copper ground wire to the green grounding screw on the inside of the new light. Form a loop in the wire in a clockwise direction so it binds to the screw as you tighten. Next, slide a wire nut over each pair of wires and twist the wires from the house to the matching color wire on the fixture, white to white, black to black, or as indicated by the instructions. Screw the wire nuts down tight onto the twisted wires. Wrap electrical tape around the bottom of each nut if you're at all uncertain. Check the instructions again to make sure that the wiring connections are correct. Carefully line up the watertight gasket to form a tight seal between the fixture and the electrical box, and then attach the cover to the base with the supplied screws. Screw the spotlights into the sockets. Focus the spotlights to cover the area you wish to light. The angle of the fixture is adjusted with a screw. Loosen it to change the angle. Tighten it to lock the spotlight in place. You can usually tighten the lock nuts with your fingers, but sometimes tapping on them with a screwdriver and a hammer can tighten them further if they slip. Note that there are also small lock nuts on the threads of the fixtures to help lock the sockets precisely into position. Referring to the instructions, set the motion sensor sensitivity and delay time. The sensitivity and the delay time controls are usually found on the base of the motion detector. The motion sensor should be pointed at the area of the yard you want to cover. Turn the spotlight circuit breaker back on. You may have to adjust the setting on the motion detector until the sensitivity and delay are just right. Once set, your new motion detecting spotlight is ready to go.